Fox now looking for some help. She gets the ball to Ordorf. I believe that's a two-pointer. Is just inside the three-point line. From yeah, a lot of them probably just coming back this week from a little trip home. To Taco, she thought about the three, but then thought again. Great pass from Ordorf down low to Jacobs. She peeled off the back of her defender. Fox, uh, that could be a little bit skewed, but still rebounding the ball well. Great move by Jacobs there, driving the baseline, getting a little reverse layup, and I'm sure she found herself in a fantastic position, just couldn't get it to go. And then a three-pointer there. Jenny Johnson that time gets it up for the Cowgirls. is number zero, Miranda Martinez. Johnson again with a three-pointer. Ball hard to get now. Gets it out to Fox. She will put up the shot this time, and it's in. There you go, Keisha Fox. Found her probably the strength advantage as well. And she was not gonna let that be a jump ball and just pulled it out of there. Now she gets an offensive rebound and has a fantastic spin move and puts the layup in. And they have a few players. Is that three-point shot up? And no good from Payne. And an offensive rebound into points. There you go, Metro State women's basketball. Is Hannah Stabanovic. Offensive rebounds. Payne puts up another three-pointer here. Maybe she likes the left side better. It's, it's nothing but net. This is down and get out. Put her hand up. Force a bad shot for Brittany Brown. Now Jacobs puts up a shot and it's in. Life of a freshman. Well, some weeks are going to look good, some weeks are not. Keisha Fox puts the three-pointer up. Trying to find their spot in this squad for Coach Javi and the Roadrunners. And there's one of them right there, newcomer to the team at least, Brittany Curl. Puts up a shot, can't get it to go in. Puts up another one spinning and fading away into Curl. Now Fox puts up another three-pointer and she hits again, Eric. Just cannot miss from beyond three. It's now a career high in points for her. From Farmington, New Mexico. And she puts it in the net there. 61 to 48 now. Metro did a fantastic job to take the three-point shot away for the most part through this game. And again, another fantastic effort by them in rebounding, Eric. Yeah, we did. We had a really good week of practice, and we were able to really impose our will defensively. I think that was the difference in the game. And we were a little sluggish offensively, but you know, too many turnovers. Didn't shoot the ball extremely well, but you know, their zone definitely caused us some problems. But I think our deep defending and rebounding got us over the top tonight. So it's a great win to come back off the break and on the on our home floor.